Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Biohazard Director's Cut. And I've just got to say, why is Jill just kind of hands on her hips, just sitting next to Richard that just died about 20 seconds ago? I don't know, just got to say that, man. You know? Anyway, um, zoom through here. Poor Richard. In the remake, he lasts a lot longer, I'll tell you that. God damn, I need a lighter in here. <laughs> oh well, we'll come back to it. After we do one, and another ink ribbon. Or six, I should say. Uh, we'll deal with Mr. Snake first. I should probably get, go grab a herb for actually, because I'm going to need it. Shotgun at the ready and all. It's quite possibly the biggest shotgun ever. Alright. Leave that for later. We can mix that with a herb in the box. Or we can use it after the battle if need be. Fact. Fact. Good shout. Got rid of that key. Go get that other herb. Sorry if I'm running back and forth here. I finally see some action, you know. Richard got anything on him? No. Alright, so let's... I've been saying alright a lot, haven't I? I've been watching too much Luke Morse. He says that a lot. Alright. That and uh, like Andy or uh, Gamers on Five Thousand has been saying. I've been saying, not gonna lie, a lot as well, which I will agree. Ah, uh, it's like a snake. It's quite easy, not gonna lie. Just, I can't really remember the trick. You just got to kind of run circles. Really. Oh, Oh no! Ah! Up the road! No, oh, he's going away. Yeah, run! Pussy! Better not say that later. <laughs> you fucked me up, man. I'm not going to lie, that was a lot easier in the GameCube. Oh, shotgun shells. I need to find a blue herb and all, because I'm poisoned. Oh, 
Oh, I know what happens actually. Uh, anything else in here? Or worth looking at? I don't think there's anything really. Let's run back outside. Memory serves me correct. Yeah. Am I poisoned? Give me the serum. Oh no. Who could it be? I know who it is, but. Sure, I feel. Oh, Christ, my leg. Ah. And we're good. Right, I think we're going to go for a wee item run spree, so I'm just going to shove all this back. And we're going to go look for some items. And I'm going to quickly save my game here. I really like this save music, actually. Yeah, they, they changed the... Uh, most of the soundtrack for the director's cut. Some of it's better, some of it's not so good. I definitely like the safe thing better than director's cut though. Everything's looking good. Done. Shut that. That with the healing stuff, and we're all good. It's all good, guys. I saved it, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> all right. So I know exactly where to go. Actually, pick up some items. Get that lighter, that red herb as well. So uh, whilst that comes to my mind, actually, uh, if you're quite if you're quite into the first Resident Evil, I definitely recommend checking out the DS version, uh, Resident Evil Deadly Silence or DS. Uh, very very good game. Probably one of my probably my favourite DS game actually. I've played it so many times. It's so much fun. Um, and it's it comes with like a remastered mode, so you can do a lot of the puzzles with the touch screen. Like there's one where you have to like shove a knife through each of your fingers, it's really quite fun. It's really good. And there's one more back remember when Richard uh was dying, uh you had to try like resuscitate him uh by blowing into the the microphone. <laughs> so that was quite interesting. You had to like do CPR to the DS, which was quite awkward if, especially if you were on a train or something. <laughs> Oh yeah, pick up the lighter. I'm just waiting for like one of the zombies to jump out of these doors like they did in the remake. I remember the hunter jumping out on me and I just a bit wet myself. Something down here. Or 
I was just in the remake. I keep running the remake up, don't I? <laughs> Got the full map in the mansion now. Or the second floor. And you got a nice wee fire going. Yeah. 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 Hmm. Alright, uh, I can't go in there yet. That's where in that door in the red, so this is where we fight the snake again later actually. Again, show them who's the boss. Anyway, um, what have I have to do next? Actually, can't think of it. I've got pretty much everything. Uh, oh, yeah. We're actually getting quite close to leaving the mansion for a short time. You actually leave and go to the the residence which is on the mansion's grounds. yourself here because there's a zombie in here if I can remember. Oh, no. I remember ever being a zombie in... Um, I don't know. I'm gonna get some bazooka rounds. Nothing to go on though which is kind of annoying me. Um, I've kind of forgotten where we go next. Oh, wait, we've got both of Suncrest, don't we? So we can probably leave, actually. And I'm going to head back to the, you guessed it, the safe room. And I'm going to end, end it there, really. So I'm going to go eat some hot dogs, and then I'm going to have to go study uh, computer science. God damn it. I try. I got. I got. I got quite a, f a, wee, a few bit into the course last night, but oh god, it's so dry. It's so boring. And again, it doesn't get much better because later tonight I've got software development to look at. So uh, that's what I say. Then I've got networking, which I'm just not even gonna bother looking at because I've done it so many times. And networking's pretty straightforward if you're on the internet a lot. And if you've got a few idea about domain names, hosts, DNS servers, and all that. And oh my god, we broke the, we broke the 15 minute mark, folks. Not good. Okay, I'm done. Be cheeky and we'll go over it a wee bit. 
Anyway, so uh, yeah, uh, should have a wee interesting part. I'm actually excited to record the next part now. Uh, should have an exciting part next episode. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.